Hey everybody, it's Darcy and I'm the Bad Artist from London, Ontario. This quite possibly, this video could change your life and how you think about flamingos. I'm doing a flamingo today. This is a subscriber's uh, request from my friend Cameron. She's the person that drives that big um, t uh, potato truck with the, the big potato on the back around the country. Um, so thank you for that Cameron. But it's funny, um, I've said my videos are full of useless information and this was a life-changing event for me when I did this flamingo and I didn't even figure it out until after I did the painting. Okay, so we're going to get into a couple things, um, but first I want to show you a couple pictures of flamingo logos. And if everyone can do this, that's, oops, that's sort of what a flamingo looks like, right? Okay, so here we go. Let's look at these logos first. Oh, and uh, Memorial Day weekend in the United States. So I hope you're having a fun Memorial Day weekend for all my friends in uh, the south of me, in America. Thanks. What are you doing? Okay, so take a look at the logos here. And the one thing I want you to focus on is you see how there is the beak and then the, the or the nose on the bill and then the mouth is underneath. Very similar in all the logos. Uh, and you can see it. I've looked up several of these images and the mouth is always, always, always under the big nose of this bird on its beak. Okay, so remember that. Now, we're going to get into the speed painting here. And uh, fascinating creatures. Um, they can live up to 50 years in captivity. Generally only about 30 in the wild though. They lay one egg per year. And if it's destroyed by predators or whatever, they don't lay any more. <clears throat> a lot of these birds are actually gray and not pink. And it depends a lot on their diet. For example, if they eat a lot of sh shrimp, which is pink, those pigments tend to go into the feathers of adult flamingos. They fly 35 uh, miles per hour, but they look really awkward because they stick their full neck out and they stick their full legs out. So you can imagine it's pretty gaudy looking. Um, they, um, the classic lawn ornament of the pink flamingo was made in 1957 and currently there are more plastic flamingo lawn ornaments in the world than there are actual flamingos. Um, I did this um, watercolor uh, with a lot of uh, glazing and I've talked in my past videos. Glazing is basically putting down one color, for example, pink, and then in order to get a darker pink, you don't add blacks or darker shades, you just keep layering on more layers of pink so that in the darker areas it's more and more pigment and you can see that around its neck and its eyes and then everything like that. Uh, these flamingos can stand up to five feet tall with the neck stretched out. Now, I'm adding some green in the background here. But this whole time I was painting this, and this is a fascinating part, I was thinking, okay, where the heck is its mouth? Uh, you got this big nosy beak, um, and in all the logos, which I showed you earlier, the mouth is underneath. So I finally went on to Google and I googled flamingo with an open mouth and this is the fascinating part that I never ever realized the beak of a flamingo is actually uh, about 20% nose look at that 20% nose and about 80% chin so here comes another one you can see that all along what I thought and I think most people think is it's not just a big huge nose it's actually a a beak uh, or a chin and the most of the this nose is the chin and the mouth is up a lot higher and it's not below like the previous logos uh, that I showed you at the beginning of the movie so that was my earth-shattering flamingo news and um, again I, ca I couldn't believe it uh, um, my whole life I thought it was just one big honking nose and little did I know it has to do a lot with a chin. And um, so anyway, um, that's my outstanding, useless, trivial 
trivia video. Uh, hope you have a great Memorial Day weekend. Thanks to the subscribers for subscribing and the likes I'm getting. It's fantastic. Uh, hope you're all well and you're taking care of your family. And um, go out and enjoy a flamingo uh, sightseeing tour if you're near them. They mostly hang around in uh, the Florida and tropical areas. So other, not just Florida, but other uh, hot areas of the uh, United States. Anyway, thanks very much. Hope you have a great day. And now you know about what a flamingo bill is. I never knew that. I never, ever knew that. Have a great day.